Now, Homer Simpson once said, if you want to remember something, get a tattoo. <laughs> Lee Weir has taken that advice quite literally and is a Guinness World Record holder for the most tattoos of the same cartoon character tattooed on the body. Now, the tattoos are of the man himself, Homer Simpson, and Lee has 41 <laughs> of them. 41! Welcome, Lee. Thank you. Yeah, well, thanks for having me. I'm glad you're taking your top off so we can see some of your tattoos because you arrived in a sweatshirt. I'm like, where are the tattoos? <laughs> it's a cold Monday. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, that is a cold Monday, but you've got your sleeve out now. Yeah. Very colourful. Um, ladies and gentlemen, what do we think of that? Piece of art. Oh, nice. Yeah. We like it. Yeah. yeah. So how did this all start? Um, well, I got, a, I got my first tattoo of Homer up here, this guy here, in 2007 when I was studying uh, radio, and I just thought it'd just be a fun thing to do. I'm a big, sh big fan of the show and thought, yeah, Homer Simpson tattoo, not many people would have many of those. Pretty cool. Yeah, so I got one and then thought I'd leave this arm and I'd get a Simpsons-themed uh, sleeve with different characters. Um, it just took too long to decide who to put on and who to leave off. Um, and then in 2012, uh, towards the end of the year, I just thought, I'm just going to focus on Homer. And I studied radio in 2007, so it was like a five-year <laughs> process as to what I was going to have on there. But yeah, I just went with Homer and never gone back. So you've got Homer's on your arm. Yes. Where yeah. else is he? Um, uh, well, no, that's it. That's, that's it, yeah. 41 for now, Homer's. For now, he's only on my arm. He may appear somewhere else should someone decide to take issue with what I've done and beat my record. That, oh, would be, that would be a personal yeah. vendetta and then I'll have to get some more. Well, I wanted to talk about the record because congratulations in the Guinness Book of Records for 2017 and we'll talk a bit more about that soon, but was it getting the record that made you get them or did you just one day think, oh, wow, well, I've got enough, maybe I should look and see how many there actually are in the record book? That's exactly what happened. Right. I, I didn't set out to achieve a record. I, um, I was getting tattooed uh, and when I, when I decided on the theme for my sleeve, I said to my tattooer, I said, hey, look, this is what I want. And he said, well, we can put a couple of Homer Simpsons on you as stamps, if you will, and then just work in some kind of a theme. Or because it's Homer Simpson, we can just have him popping out from behind himself and just to stack your arm. He said, stack your arm with Homer. I thought, that doesn't sound too bad. And then I was getting done. I was about halfway through my sleeve and I was counting them all. And I thought, God, there's a lot of Homer Simpsons on my arm. I wonder yeah. if there's a world record for this. And that's all it was, and then from there it just went nuts. I looked into it and there wasn't. And so I thought, well, maybe I'll set one. And that's kind of what I did. And nice. you did. So yeah. is, it, is it true that you actually gave up drinking beer for a year to fund the sleep? I did. I did. I know you can't tell, you can't tell looking at me, but I did for a whole year. Um, yeah, I just, I just thought I'd have a, have a year off. I mean, it, it wasn't an issue or anything. I just thought I'd just have a year off and save a bit of money and get some tattoos. And yeah, so I gave up beer for a year and spent the money that I would have spent, along with some chippings from the wife on some tattoos. And speaking of the wife, how does she feel about it? Even, you know, your extended rallies, you know, have they always said, what are you doing, or are they pretty supportive? I've had that question for most of my life. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Come on. Um, but I think it's just kind of, it's just kind of acceptable now. It's just, I love it. It's yeah. just what Lee does. You know, I mean, you could convince me right now if you were going to pay to get the cafe logo tattooed somewhere. Oh, okay. Yes! Right. Do it, whip around. Yes. <laughs> yes. Whip around. Yeah. Well, well, we're not going to talk about the tattoo that Mike's got somewhere on his body, but that, oh, was, from, yes, that yes. was from a previous life. Yes, um, so what does your daughter think about this and your children? She loves it. I've got a four-year-old Lucy, um, and when I was, when I was getting... Because I didn't get it all done in one go, because that would have been mental. Um, I, had them, I had most of the outline done in one go, and through, uh, over the year we'd just have a day where... I I'd go in and we'd do all the red and then all the yellow and then all the green. And so there was often months at a time where there was just outlines of Homer Simpson. So I'd just give Lucy some felts and let her colour in oh, cool. and colour in the Homer's like a, like a colouring book, if you will. And she just would colour in on my skin. She wasn't very good at staying in the lines, but... <laughs> well, you know what, I think that's, that could be maybe the next arm going in. And I think we should also get a cafe-themed yeah. one on his back or something. No, and I'll tell you what, we'll keep in touch and see yeah. how this develops. Yeah, yeah. Congratulations yeah. for being on the 2017 Guinness Thank World you. Book of Records, um, because that is quite an honour, in all honesty. So congratulations, yeah. good work. Guinness World Records 2017 book. That's Thank available you. at all good bookshops shops right now. Thank you so much, Lee.